great concern. You know, I suppose, uh, you know, Fabe Rawls going to come back, you know, obviously after what happened last year and so on like that. And we knew that, we knew what we were facing and, uh, yeah, we beat Rufus by the old performance fish in the first half. So really tough night, fish and flies. You would have expected maybe the week before it was probably coming up with a bit cleaner and we'd the venue and just thought it was all, it was awkward the whole way coming up yeah, to you. Yeah, you had that when you go yeah, away, but look, I'm a firm believer the best team always wins, they're the best team tonight, we've absolutely no complaints, but we are disappointed with, you know, I suppose the way we perform, but one thing we'll say is, you know, this championship is going to be a hard, it's not a sprint, yeah. and this time the first night, one game down, we'll three to go, I'm still fully happy. Uh, and convinced with the group we have inside that we can compete for most of the title games. No question there, but you have to understand like now one of those players that took the field tonight for Tipperary started in last year's championship. They are probably where, where we were last year, where they compete for eight or nine, ten match and all around that panel and, and that's huge. But our boys can get the experience tonight, you know, we can build on that for you. Physically they were a bit bigger and probably the scrappy weather fed into their hands or knocking lads off the ball. Just a, even that year physically at this age. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I would probably say, you know, we just didn't work hard enough. We did not work hard enough, especially in the first half. Uh, puck outs hurt us a bit and then we couldn't get to the breaking ball but you know all those things that I've seen out there that went wrong for us tonight like, I think they're well fixed for and uh, I think we still have a big year ahead big championship ahead with a uh, fantastic sort of five you know men squad side that I'm happy with but tonight was a huge learning curve for each and every one of them absolutely well back to the goal the second goal that, that, that Claire got Six point turnaround, maybe we could have got a goal just in second quarter. Yeah, yeah, you know, and again, no, probably a lack of inexperience. I thought, you know, in the ball back, we should have just buried it there and then we we didn't take the opportunity and back up, and it was a, a killer blow. Then obviously that goal, you know, because I'm not sure. I maybe clear about one and one, two, one, three in the second half back, so we had him limited enough. We just probably failed and probably overpaid some of our balls out around the middle third, and probably needed to get it in a, a bit quicker. And hey, look, they worked us really hard as well. Conditions were uh, tough for both teams. And um, you know, like the goal was a killer in the second half. I think we were calling him back, calling him back, and they obviously maybe again to run the play slightly. And um, but look, they put for us too. But huge experience happened last year, and our lads, you know, will gain huge experience from tonight. That is one thing, you know, that they will gain is massive experience tonight. They got huge exposure here. And um, you know, we've got 24, about 20 players on the field. They haven't played much time to before, and that will absolutely bode well for the board for And what are the biggest work ons for the next day? Oh, sure. Look, uh, I, I, I think the, the values that we still in the team, uh, and that's uh, honesty, desire, passion, belief, all that kind of stuff. Uh, probably not you know, things not to do with hurling, but when the dirty ball is there to be won, we didn't win it tonight. Especially didn't win enough. Yeah, and you kind of said that in the preview as well that it's you're not going to know where lads are at until they get into their first match. And yeah, when they get into the first half. But look, I'm within the half time. I was still happy. They did all the hurling done. I know what without maybe eight points or whatever at half time. But we've been down there before. And we, there was no issue, you know, you come back. We had all the opportunities in the second half. Um, but I suppose the goal was that the, the goal, if we didn't get the goal this in, it would have been a huge yeah. score for us. Uh, but we are where we are, probably again in two weeks' time. There's no medals being handed out tonight. That second half display that you gave there, you'd be very happy with that. You didn't get off the blocks in the first half, but this, the second half you really counted for yourself well. Yeah, yeah, we did, but I suppose a lot of that was down to fear. They're physically stronger, walk really hard, have a good system of play going for them as well, you know, and uh, they're probably only going to get stronger as well because they'll bounce on from tonight and give a couple of players out into as well to come back into them as well, you know. But yeah, definitely happy to take the and, uh, and uh, work on, on what we need to work on for the next day and what we're going to do. A lot of hurling to be done yet, Chad. A lot of hurling to be done. Yeah. yeah. Well done. Thanks. Thanks very much. Thanks. 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 Thanks.